it was super fun to be able to get well not back with everyone but back with about half the team the other half was there and we just had to pretend like they weren't there like social distancing and stuff and it's just weird because we can't really touch each other and like volleyball is a really touchy like high five sport and like just like pushing each other around and stuff like that so that's always tough we have to elbows now so well, so my grandma and my mom both played there from Mexico, so they had like a different style of playing, but I began when I was six years old. My mom was my first coach. It was like a little NYS, like rec league. And then I started getting into club when I was seven. I started going to camps at this club called Zona back in Tucson, Arizona. So those were like my first experiences. To be able to follow in like my family's footsteps was also always a big deal for me. Like at first I was a little sketch about playing volleyball because I really wanted to play basketball. But then my mom really pushed me towards volleyball and once I actually started it, it I fell in love with it immediately. Uh, a few years back there was a player called Inki Ajanuku at Stanford and she, I used to work at U of A as like a ball shagger, so I always got to get really close with the players. And I was able to talk with her and she she always like inspired me. She was the same position as me and she was the same height as I am now, which is like pretty short for my position. So she's always inspired me because she's always been a super hard worker and she's absolutely amazing on the court. It was just like the community type feeling. Like there's like because the first day I got here, I also went to the city. And then the next day I visited the campus. So in Phoenix, there's also like the big city, Phoenix, but then there's a lot of small cities around it. And that's exactly what this is. So. I try not to be super that superstitious because one tournament, my team was like overly superstitious. Ended up, it ended up fighting us back and then but I do always listen to music, type me up. If I have time, I love to get a nap in before game days. Like, I'm a huge napper.